Hello guys, I am Flippy and today I'm bringing you guys a new series that will be called the Minecraft Minigames. Basically what the purpose of this series is, is to make little mini games for you guys to play after you complete Feast and after you kill everyone else in the Hunger Games for MC PvP and all you have left is your teammates. So for example, you killed everyone, all the enemies, now it's just you and your friend left and you don't really want to PvP or one of them is much better than the other and it wouldn't be much of a competition or you guys just want to have a little bit of fun and all of the items that I'll use in these mini games you will be able to get from feast it's not always certain that you will get the items but they will be in the chest most likely so basically how this works is you put a four high any kind of block thing just so oh God, I'm terrible explaining you make a four high stack of any kind of block and then you make one block coming out at the top towards the other person over there and then an easy way to do this is just like this or or you could just do this one, two three four and you make one coming out there we go and then you make a wooden button and for you guys who don't know how to make it you just take one wooden plank and put it in your crafting table and you will get a wooden button. And then the TNT will be in feast, although if it's not in feast you could just kill some creepers and make it yourself. And something I always like to do is I always like to do add a cobweb here, but you want to break one block right underneath. So just add a cobweb if, if the feast has it, because then it prevents anyone from escaping if they're about to die, because a lot of people will do that, even your friend. So what you're going to do is one person is going to get in their cobweb, sink to the bottom, and their enemy will be over there. Ooh, that beautiful sunset. So you guys want to be about maybe 50 blocks away. That's what I like to do. At first, it's really hard to get, but after some tries, you'll get it. So then the objective is to shoot the other person's button, and then the TNT will ignite and drop and kill your friend and you will be the winner of the Hunger Games or you will have just one little mini game depends what you're doing okay so you want to be about 50 blocks apart you can be shorter or longer if you're longer then um, you better have more arrows because if you run out then you'll be then you can't play this mini game so if you only have like two arrows each and you want to be a lot closer together so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take aim there are two types of ways you can play this game you can take turns or you can just go rapid fire and just shoot your arrows and not take turns and whoever dies first. I like to play that game better because it's more exciting because you don't have to like wait for the other person to shoot and see if you're going to die. And then you also don't have to like argue about who's going to shoot first. So let me see if I can get it. Oh, I hit it first try. Yes. It's really not that easy. If this is like your first time doing it, you're going to take a lot of tries. As you can see, this is really far away. I made 50 blocks. So, just get an idea of how I'm shooting it. I've practiced a lot of times, so I basically know the spots. But, that is about it guys. This game is called TNT Drop. And if you guys want to see more mini games like this, then give me some feedback and some comments and likes in the comments and like box below. Okay guys, well thank you for watching. Goodbye.